uh, had a real tough start actually, although that was a good start before we uh, got in our, our first business. So we always thought of ourselves as sustainability partners to corporates and that's what we wanted to do. We thought about what products should we offer. Uh, solar was very expensive in 2010. It was maybe uh, 11, 12, 13 rupees per unit of power. So we said, Kaun kharidega at 12, 13 rupees, no one's going to be interested. So we got into gas fired cogen, right? And that was a viable proposition. We thought, you know, we would uh, make a going of it. What happened was May 2011, there was a tsunami in Japan followed by Fukushima. Uh, so Japan shut down all nuclear power production facilities, bought out all the world's LNG to enhance the load factors on their gas plants. And so natural gas prices nearly doubled. Right? And, and then Forex also keeps going up, down and all. So by, uh, and by the way, by in the same year, 2011, by Diwali, the legendary investor who would put money in us also shut their business in India and fired everyone we knew. So you know, all the, if you think about a perfect storm of bad shit which can happen, it all happened to us as soon as we started. Probably better it happens to you when you start uh, than much later. Uh, uh, I think, it, it, you know, uh, if nothing else, uh, uh, it, it teaches you humility. Uh, we certainly as a team and the same team continues to be the leadership of the company even today. Uh, and now we have 500 megawatt of uh, solar which we sell to, uh, you know, clients for their, for meeting their green aspirations uh, and cost saving aspirations. Uh, but you know, we, we never once think that because of us this is successful. You know, because if, because of us it was successful then gas cogen should also have been successful. Right? It's, there's many more things than just effort and quality of team and people which takes to make that a success. So that was our journey there. 